BN Boxing News. Hey, Fight fans, how you doing? This is Nick with BN Boxing News. I'm coming to bring you some good news, man. <laughs> yes, indeed. Errol Spence Jr., I mean, he walked into the ring and confronted Showtime Sean Porter. Basically did to him the exact same thing that he did to Danny Garcia. Told him, hey, man, I'm challenging you to fight me next. And uh, Showtime Porter said he accepted the offer. I mean, it's a good thing in the welterweight division. I can't believe what's about to happen. Okay, as it seems, Errol Spence wants all the smoke. I mean, <laughs> even after the uh, after that confrontation, he went on to the post-conference and spoke to the media in reference to wanting to fight Showtime Porter and possibly any one of the other welterweights. Uh, he even spoke about possibly fighting Keith Herman in the future. Saying that if he gave him a chance, he would knock him out within six rounds. I mean, hey, he was on one last night, Fact fans. I mean, hey, he wants all the smoke bringing his weight. He even went on to say, hey, we had the same, we fight on the same network, same management. Uh, the money's going to be there. There's no excuses. He laid it all out on the line. And, you know, he went on to talk about uh, Terrence Brock. Crawford saying that he went ahead and signed a contract with Bob Arum with the smoke and mirrors, meaning you know basically you guys fight for a different management company. You guys basically fight for different networks, and he's not willing to go over to ESPN. So it's going to be a little bit more difficult to make that fight. Due to Bud Crawford fighting under the top rank banner. Um, uh, today, those same two guys is going at it on Twitter. You know, uh, back and forth, back and forth. So, they're at war. I can't believe what's happening. It needs to all happen. 2019 is going to be a very interesting year. We all can't wait for it to go down. I can't wait. Um, until then, until next news, peace, the end.